the second event we've done for the kids and stuff, it feels great us giving, you know, not one person can do it. We're all doing it. You know, at one given time, there's one to seven cop cars called out here a day for, you know, kids fighting and selling drugs. So with our efforts, I'm sure we could do something to fix this place up. I want to tell everybody thanks for being here. Other than all the stuff in the skate park, the money's there. The money will be here, too. <laughs> and here, I want Sam, me, Sam, and Amy, we'll try to do some more of these and make some good things happen. Thank you all. <laughs> all right, thanks for putting it on. It's a lot of work. Guys, help us. You know, it's all about giving back. I was watching one of those shows on TV last night about 9-11. And you see firemen who either getting off duty or had not made it home yet or was at home and heard what was going on on the radio and they all responded to help people. You know, as a police officer, you never know when you kiss your wife goodbye if you ever come home again. And a couple times, I almost didn't. But God has a plan. And even though it was a tragedy 10 years ago, a lot of good has come out of it. And it's about you guys here today, giving up your time, your money, your effort for the kids, because we know it's about the kids. The kids will make, you know, people complain. There's no jobs. They complain. Anderson doesn't have a future. It's dying. Ladies and gentlemen, because of what we learned from 911, we learned about our fellow man. These are our future of Anderson. These are the kids that are someday going to make it happen here. So we can't give up on them. And you guys are awesome for being here today. Kevin and I have joked about our past together, but I am telling you, if it wasn't for God and Kevin's effort to reach out to his boys, I wouldn't be here. But he is a man that means what he says. And I think that every time he gets on that bike, he's thinking, what can I do to help someone else? 9-11 was probably one of the worst things that ever happened to the United States. And we will never forget. We shall never forget. But on this anniversary tomorrow, think about what happened. Not only was it police officers, firemen, and EMPs that was responding, think about the men and women who were just common everyday citizens working in the Trade Center and within minutes turn into heroes, saving their fellow workers, walking down with fellow workers the 100 flights of stairs because the way the people just said could never have made it without them. But they didn't leave them behind. And that's what you guys are doing today. You're not leaving Anderson behind. You're helping them walk step by step so someday Anderson would be back where it was, if not better. The guys riding on the bikes today, thank you. You know, guys who ride Harleys, it's kind of like semi-drivers. When it comes to road safety, doing the right thing, you guys aren't kids playing around. You're out there riding the revive, doing things right. It's like semi-drivers. They do it right when they're out there driving. Guys, thank you for your time and effort. Thank you for everyone who's volunteering over there with the hot dogs and the kids uh, jumping. And I'm even going to say, hey, after a while, thank you for dunking me. <laughs> Pay your money. It's worth every bit out of it. But before we leave, I'd like to say a prayer. So if you can give me two seconds of your time, please, and then I'm going to give the mic back to uh, Kevin here. He's got something he wants to do. 
Heavenly Father, thank you for this time we could be together. We ask that you put your hand over our Harley riders today and they'll be safe and there's no accidents. Lord, be with us today as we remember 9-11. Remember, Lord, that it's about you, it's about our fellow man, and then it's about us. Thank you for this time. Bless this event and many more that we plan to have ahead, Lord. Thank you for everyone here. Amen. Amen. Before I get started again, let's give Billy Lawson a, a hand of applause for the, hit, the work he did in the skate park for all. See this little guy right here? Every time we came out here to do something, we've been here wanting to help, pick up trash, want to pick out, you know, send out flyers. This little guy here, one of the reasons why it makes us want to do the things we're doing. From me, from me and Amy, Amanda and Sam, there's your new bicycle. So you don't got to win it. You just got it for being used. 